and welcome back to Sly Raccoon. I'm Mark Durax and this is Sly Raccoon. Um, before this episode begins, I am going to admit a thing. I tried out some stuff with my audio that didn't work out, so I already caught this episode once. So I already kind of cleared this level, but I didn't get all the bottles, so let's do that this time. And uh, so I'm going to go through all the levels I did do. But I'm gonna do them again because I I did two levels with bottles and I missed them both because I'm a, I am a jackass. So that is basically what happened. Is that not just wonderful? When everything works out like it like it doesn't, you know, life. I hate life. Don't you hate life? Now nah, actually, life's pretty good if you got stuff figured out. Now, I don't know if I have to get all of the bottles again. I don't think so. Just the ones I didn't get. Right? Maybe. Yes, no, maybe so. Get the checkpoint and the... Oh, hello there, dude. You just standing here guarding your stuff. I that was glitchy. Okay. Sneaky, 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 sneaky. I sneaky, 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 sneaky. <laughs> Just on par. Uh, yeah, because there were bottle, bottles down here, remember that. And it's a little tidy little bitch hole there where you hide the stuff that you have and stuff, stuff, stuff. Everything, everything is stuff. Everything is stuff when the stuff is the stuff. That doesn't make sense. Hey there, hey there dude. All right, I can sneaky, sneaky. I I've become so sneaky in the past eleven episodes. This is the twelfth, I do believe. I am the sneakiest little bastard round. Okay. Now my friends and I had a discussion about who would win in a fight, a raccoon or a human. We came to the conclusion that human would win, but then we came to the, the thing with uh, if there were it was a kid and uh, I'm just looking for bottle. There, ah, I missed a safe. Wonderful. I'm missing five more bottles, so I missed quite a few when I did the trial thing, and I forgot to copy my save file like an idiot. So I'm redoing it. But hey, whatever. It works out in the end. Uh, so yeah, who win the kid like, uh, say, a seven-year-old kid versus a raccoon, like a real-life raccoon? Who would win? I said that the raccoon would win, cause I mean it's fierce, it's wild, it's scary as all hell. But my friend Alex, whom you might have seen in one of in my past in one of my past videos. Now, two of past videos at time of this uploading. Uh, on the tie, tie the Tasmanian Tiger Let's Play thing we do here on the Octoax Incorporated. I'm just jumping from thought to thought right now. Okay, where was I? Right. My buddy Alex, Suicide Gizmo, who helps me with the tie, the Tasmanian Tiger Let's Play. That guy. He said, and my other friend who shall not be named because he's a buttfuck. Okay, there, dude. Thank you so much for he he hurting me. Don't do it again. Don't. Okay, yeah, yeah. You want to taste the sword? Taste my cane instead, bitch. Yeah, there you go. Uh, and my other friend who is kind of wise ass. I know you're watching, so yeah, you're wise ass, dude. <laughs> Anywho. I should really finish my stories. It's a thing I have to learn to do. Uh, so, they said that they thought a kid would win. Because it's a human, it's much more than a raccoon. But, I mean, in a hand on hand combat, it's. It's like. It's not. I, what's the word? It's primitive. So, why would not a. Yo, man, being, I mean, a wild animal win, because they're like, it's their nature. Okay, so we have the safe here and the end of the level, but I'm still missing five bottles. What the fuck? And I was more, I, I looked a little everywhere this time. 
I've missed them twice now. There's got there's just gotta be somewhere a little hidey hole somewhere somewhere. There they there, there, there they are. Ra ra ra. So I mean that was a coin. Good I guess. Oh I see it. I see it. It's this way. I saw a little bodily fox. Come on now. Speeding rocket of doom and there is only three. <sighs> so I am missing a safe. <laughs> I'm not salty. <laughs> what are you talking about? I mean I haven't like gone through this level twice now without finding it. So I mean what are my chances of finding it? this time and I can't really go back can I go in here I cannot okay well fuck it then I'm gonna have to run through this level again I guess off screen to get the to get the final the final 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 and show it on screen at the end of this episode I guess why not right so where was I Raccoon and people versus It's like a death battle. It's time for a death battle But seriously, who do you think would win uh, like okay? Let's not say seven cuz that's kind of unfair. Let's say a ten-year-old kid versus a raccoon Cuz I'm I, I think a raccoon would win. I mean, they're not as dumb as people think. I mean look at Slayer is smart as fuck And I mean the more fierce they're very aggressive and uh, yeah so I think that okay so basically I unlocked that in the last what the f wait a second <gasps> regrowing doors spooky scary stuff so basically we have to unlock this to get up to that thing up there on top and guess who's there the big thing that's here the panic king is up there it's basically what Bentley said and okay I am going to just try to sneak my way through this guy here not through this guy behind him through him would be like satanic I mean that would be just hurtful and we got another floating turret level which I've done I've said several times now that I've done these things but guess if people are stupid and just watch part of the videos I am saying it multiple times so they don't gel in the comments but people do anyway cuz welcome to YouTube where people are stupid and creators are even stupider to expect differently I just love that quote from uh, I think what Albert Einstein wasn't it uh, stupidity is uh, Doing the doing the same thing, expecting different results, which is basically what what I'm doing right now. <laughs> so I guess I'm stupid. Well, shit me. I'm just breezing through here, guys. Don't mind me. Just closing down your forts and the rocket. Boost that rocket into the wall. Noise. Fuck, fuck, fuck. And fuck, fuck, fuck. Fuck, 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 Oh my god, they come in different packs. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Close the doors. There you go. Nice job, dude. A job well done, if I may say so myself. And I may sound a little different, as I said as said in the beginning. I tampered a little bit with my microphone and my audio, but it didn't really work out because I don't didn't find an editing program that worked for me. So I might have to save up some money, like invest in ouch Adobe Premiere or something when I get a little more following on this thing. Because I mean, shouldn't waste money if like 
if the message don't go out to people. So if you do know people that like Let's Plays and stuff, or like video games in general, why don't share this to them? And I mean, we can all have a jolly good time. Cause that's really all I want. That's I ha I hate people who like who are like um, have heard of people like PewDiePie and Markiplier and all these people making gaming videos just be rich. Uh, my motive for making these things are like. Because I don't look up to, to uh, Markiplier or PewDiePie. I mean, they do good stuff, don't get me wrong. With all charity and uh, PewDiePie does his charity thing and Markiplier does collaborative stuff with uh, sometimes people who are who has less subscribers and try to help them and stuff. But, like, my... who do, Those who I look up to on YouTube are like... Well, say Josh Jepson and... Uh, Can't come up with anyone else for that. Well, but you know the common let's build like Chugga Khan, Ryan, Stephen George, those kinds of people who like who like have their own little community, but are not too big and don't let that go to their head. Because that is really what I want. Like with YouTube, is like create a kind of a community where we can all like share opinions, which is my trying to to incorporate incorporate that in the comment section. And okay, I got the flight thing with the old comment section thing. That okay, hello. I will continue soon. Shut up, Ringtail. I don't know what you're doing here in China, but I'm sure it can't be good for whoever owns this place. So me finds it creepy with the eyes staring behind Carmelita. All I see is I mean that's really creepy. Escape justice for far too long. I'm proud to be a thief. Especially when I'm, I'm proud of being a thief, at least I know I tried. These quaint temples are a front for an illegal explosives factory. Don't try to confuse the issue. You criminals are all the same, and none of you can escape justice. <sighs> She's fucking blind! Dude, criminal stuff happening. The criminal happenings. There are three bottles right here. I can't believe I missed those last time. Also, Lucky Charm. What the hell was that? I don't know if they picked up on the recording was, but it was like, bzzzd. Like when a TV goes. Okay, I was about to burn my butt. Dodging skills, uh, but yeah, basically what I want with YouTube is not to be big. I'd rather not have like one million subscribers. I'd rather I I'd, I'd be happy with maximum of like fifty. Because what I really want is, like, communicate with you guys watching my videos. And, like, share opinions. Because I always thought that was interesting. And I don't have a lot of friends who who like this, who like the same games. Like, this game I have, I have, like, none of my, none of the friends I have have played this game in its entirety before. So, I mean, you can't really have a conversation about it. But most of my friends, like, uh, one of my best friends doesn't really like video games at all. I mean, we do play video games a lot, but but it's mostly like uh, Mario Party and Mario Kart and like Smash Bros. And that is, that's about it. And sometimes retro games, but I mean, you can't really have a conversation about that as the, the same... What? Did you hear that again? It was the sound again. That's weird. But yeah, I can't really have like a deep conversation about like games and your opinion of them with with a casual game. I, I don't I don't mean to look down to casual casual gamers or something like or at all. But and if you're a casual gamer watching this, I mean, if you do you do have opinions on your own stuff? Then i am just be happy to talk about them too. I just like talking about opinions. I like people's opinions. It's basically what I'm trying to say. And I like sharing... Oh, death! I like sharing death. Death is a fine thing to share with your friends. Don't do it again! You bitch. Okay, uh, I think I got them all this time, no? Yes, no, maybe so. Yes! At least I got one of the bottle, one of the vaults, words. 
two, three, one. Could be useful. <laughs> Could be useful for finding those last two bottles in the other level. So thank you, I guess. Um, it's Fourth of July or New Year's, whatever you prefer. Watch your back, Cooper. When you least expect it, I'll be there. Waving your arm. You could just jump, but nah, that'd be too hard for you. Would it not, you little girly girl? Yep, girly girl. <laughs> okay. Oh, glitchy floors. Okay, what is happening? Okay, that was pretty scary. Uh, but that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Sly Raccoon. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and all that fun stuff. And I'll see you in the next one. Don't. Don't click away, because yes, you see it's a little bit part of the level, the, the level, the video. I'm just doing my outro now, so that I can, you know, like, don't have to do it when I get the thing. I'm going to get the two bottles, so I'll see you soon. Oh, that's dickish. Oh my god, that is dickish. Holy crap, that is the most dickish thing this game has ever done. I cannot believe that. Why would you ever look down this? I'm right here after these, like, kung fu guys, whatever. But, and on the bottom of this, on the roof of the place that I just jumped up, there's the stuff. That's just evil. Fuck you, sucker punch. That, that's just, I mean, it was good hidden. And all that, but fuck you, man. Uh, okay, basically, watch this. Unfortunately, this vault code appears to have been written in owl dialect. I won't be able to crack the code until we meet and defeat the bird who created it. Who might that be? We'll see next time.